Hey, what's up, coach? Welcome back to the podcast. If you have been enjoying the last couple of episodes that we put out, uh, I've been uploading these every Tuesday at 8 in the morning, Central. Uh, make sure, leave me any sort of feedback. The best way to leave me feedback is send me a text message. I don't care about growing my social media platform. I care about helping coaches. So if you want to talk to me, message me at 210-960-5771. If you don't live in North America, don't text that number because I can't get back to you. Um, that's it. All right. So if you want to text me, message me there. And uh, I want to get straight into today's message. So I got a message from this coach. He said, hey, Ben, I'm a brand new trainer. What are some good tips? What are some things that I need to work on at the beginning of my business? Now, what I'm going to do here with my response, it, it, it might sound like a rant, but trust me, I, I, I'm trying to uh, get my point across here. So this way you don't run into big problems. So if you are a brand new trainer and you're watching this right now, please pay close attention. So let me tell you first what not to do, right? I don't want you to build a social media brand. I don't want you to build this presence on the internet. I don't want you to do any of that. I don't want you to go to uh, canva.com and create a logo. I don't want you to go to wix.com and, and create a website. I don't want you to do any of the, the bull crap that most business professors or most people who don't have a business, they, they'll give you advice to do stuff that just doesn't work, right? Don't do any of that stuff. Don't worry about social media. Here's what I do want you to do. I want you to learn sales. That's number one. And I want you to learn sales because that's going to be the thing that puts food <laughs> on the dinner table. All right. That's going to be the thing that ultimately, like if you want to help more clients, you have to be good at sales. You have to learn sales. And at the beginning, you might really suck at that the way that I did. Right. That was really hard for me at the beginning to learn that and overcome, you know, the obstacles that were in my way. But sales is the only thing you should be focusing on at the beginning and attached to sales. Right. Is the results that your clients get. If you are great at sales, but you suck at training, you will not do this long term. So you have to be good at sales to get clients. That's number one. And when you get the clients, you need to focus on results and you need to give them the best uh, product in your area. Otherwise, they're going to go find someone that's like me that's giving a better product. Right. So this is why sales comes first. Right. Then we focus on the results because you cannot get results for clients unless you sell them into your program, right? So got to learn sales. Uh, a great free resource is my YouTube channel. I, I have so many videos, so much content here already. Um, I have other paid programs that I feel like will be great for you if, uh, if you're wanting to take the next steps and get more personalized coaching. Um, but this channel here already has so much so much content, it's all free, right? So you should check out my channel, look at the other videos I have. Um, I give hundreds and thousands of dollars of free advice away, right? Learn sales. And what I don't want you to do, again, is don't be the guy who's trying to build a social media brand. I get so many messages from coaches all day long that are like, hey, I have like a ton of Instagram followers, but no one's buying my program. This is why I'm telling you, like the size of your social media at the beginning of your business is, is so irre irrelevant. Like focus on sales, focus on helping clients and focus on getting referrals. You do those two things, um, then you don't have to worry about your social media at the beginning, right? Because at the end of the day, no one gives a crap about you on social media. They don't care about you. They don't care about where you played basketball or where you played soccer or, or where you've coached. They don't, no one cares about your resume. They care if you can help their child. So parents will absolutely care if you can help their child. If you're the one who can help their child get the transformation and see results, they are going to pay you, right? And the only way they're gonna pay you though is if you learn sales. That's it for today's message. Hopefully this helps. See you later.
Hey coach, thanks so much for listening to today's episode. If you would like to connect with me, send me a text message at 210-960-5771. And if you would like a discount to any of the programs that we have over at our website at buildmysportsbiz.com, simply head over to www.buildmysportsbiz.com. When you get there, you can see the list of the different programs that we have. Simply click through there, and once you get to the checkout page on any program, you can use the coupon code PODCAST. And when you use the coupon code PODCAST, you get a 25% discount on any product that we have. That's it for today's episode. Thanks so much for listening. I'll catch you later.